Hi guys, I am live. I'm trying out StreamYard for the first time because I want to show you some cool things with Minicam. Look at this, me. I'm learning StreamYard and Minicam in the same month. Oh my goodness, what's the word coming to you? What's next? Google Slides? Probably. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> so if you can find me on YouTube, please join me in the chat. Say hi to me. I would love to to see you and say hi to you and bring you in here. Um, if I can figure out how to get your, your chats up here, but hey, I'm trying. Okay, so <laughs> look at me go. Okay, so I'm talking back and forth. Here in my eye, I am in StreamYard. And okay, my name's Rebecca F, enough Gabby, enough Gabby. My name's Rebecca and I teach with OutSchool and with VIP Kid and a little bit with Google Kid and a little bit with Bling ABC. Those are my majority, my, my major companies. I've dabbled a little bit with other companies too, but those are my bread and butters. Right now, OutSchool and VIP Kid are my bread and butters. But I want to show you something super cool about Minicam. Okay. As many of you know, on OutSchool, I teach science experiments and math games. And often I want to show what we're doing, what the experiment is next to me. So in the past, I have added myself on my cell phone as a participant in Zoom. And so they have a separate screen and I can spotlight them or I can spotlight me. Well, then I got to thinking, I really wish there was a way to spotlight both at the same time or do dual screens or whatever. So here is what I have figured out we can do. Okay. So I made some, some, uh, some templates some filters, some whatever templates, maybe. And then each template has their own thing. So I have just me. Right now, I'm using my internal camera on my computer, okay? If I transition to this one, I'm using my external camera hanging down from a uh, thing. So I've got it hooked up to this thingy. I know it's a bit mess. This will help my cell phone in the past, okay? But I can just kind of rest it inside there so that I can use that as my second camera. So that's gonna be this, okay? But I can also transition to half and half. Ooh, look at that! And I can make this side bigger. Well, this side's small, I guess. And this side bigger. I can overlap a little bit. I've just done half and half. And I use this in my class for the first time actually today. And it actually went quite well. So let me show you what I'm doing over here. If I can figure out how to do this on StreamYard. Okay, so here we are. <laughs> so over here, here, whatever, is <laughs> my mini cam. Okay, so down here, I have my templates. Okay, I have this one was just me. I have this one, which was me with my snowman class. And I have the outline all ready to go. And my melted snowman, we made some snowmen out of marshmallows. And then we melted them in hot water and saw what happened. Okay. And this is both my internal camera. And here I have my external camera showing our project. Okay. Down here we have half and half, which is the two cameras. This one I'm kind of working on. This one is going to show my external camera, whatever camera I want. And then like my mobile device would go in this, um, wherever it is. Yeah, this this little, there. The square right here will be like my, my mobile device as my camera, which that didn't work so well. This one shows my PowerPoint of my Snowflake class. So I could it potentially... Um, go through my PowerPoint during class, which is kind of cool. So I'm trying these cool new things with templates, so to speak, okay? So let's build one together real quick. Let's build one. So I'm going to open a new one, okay? When I click on this new one, it's going to ask me which camera I want to use as my major camera. So in this case, I'll use my, mm, see, let's do internal. Let's do my internal camera, okay? Now, I'm going to add a uh what you gonna call it i'm gonna add a preset it's called a preset aha aha it's called a preset okay so i've got all my presets here here's my new preset okay let me see if anybody's here saying hi if, you, if you're here say hi 
Um, and then I'll try to bring you in if I can find the chats. <laughs> I don't want to forget about you or ignore you if you are chatting with me. Okay, so back to here. I'm going to make my preset. So in here, I jumped over here to this little um, like mountain type box at the top right here, this mountain box. I'm on preset seven right now, okay? Right now I have my internal camera, my HP camera right here. I can add a new layer. For this one, I'm going to add a layer. And it's going to show here for now. But I can edit this with this little edit pencil button, and I can figure out which way I want to do. Do I want just the one picture? Do I want one picture with the little box there? Do I want a picture with two boxes there? Side by side, top and bottom, or four squares, okay? So I could do two squares if I want to. Let's try this. Two squares. Whoa! See, I like this, but you can't see my mouth. I'm hiding. I'm hiding. So it could work. I could do like a PowerPoint here and a video camera here if I want to. And I could like go really tall here. Hi, guys. And then you can see both. That's kind of cool. Yeah, I like that one. But it could be kind of busy. Okay. So I'm going to give it one. I'm going to go to just the one. I don't know if you can see what I'm doing over here. But here's just the one. I'm going to save it. Once you save it, it pops up. Now. I can decide what to put into this box. So in this one, I'm going to click the add button and I'm going to choose any one I want. The game, IP cameras, mobile device, images, videos, PowerPoint, PDF, a YouTube URL, desktop, color source, web source URL, RTMP servers, NDI, I don't know, these are weird. Okay, but I'm going to do my other camera here. My Logitech is my um, external camera. So in this case, I would have my face here and my excise experiment here. We were doing magic milk today with the soap and the milk and the fruit kind and the reactions. That's cool. So I could do this if I wanted to, or I could go down here, number two, and I could do it side by side. So whichever one I would like to do at that moment, I can do that. And then I did not save it. That's my bad. I did not save it. I think I have to save it. I thought I saved it, but we're going to go back. We can just make it again. See, made it again. Good. Um, and then there's no way to really save it, but I guess if I go back to here, it's, it's saved. So you can have like a bunch of these presets that you can then toggle through. So when I'm in VIP kit or I'm out of school, I just have to open Manicam first. Okay, Manicam first, and then go to... the VIP kid website or like Zoom or whatever video I have to do. And then I can choose many cam as my camera and then I can do all this fun stuff. I mean, this is just showing you how to do the presets. I mean, the borders are something completely different. That's pretty cool. Uh, this is my preset one. I didn't want this here, so I can take away. I can, um, I can just uh, go over here to the side. See, I can point, look, my preset, um, this is preset one. Oh, this is preset one. Oh, they're all numbered weird. Okay, fine, fine. I'll just take away, X that out and go bye-bye, okay? One thing I learned, and this is a you know fine detail, is if I'm on here and I, I wanna touch something, I can move things around, but I can't delete it from here. I actually have to find it over here in the list and then delete it from the list. But it is kind of cool to work with. So in another video, I'll show you how to use some of these other buttons, okay? My favorite ones right now are the, the presets, which I'm doing, as well as down here, the effects, which is the little magic wand. That magic wand has so much cool things I'll show you in a different video, okay? You guys, this was fun. Thank you guys for coming today, okay? Um, I didn't see you be live in the chat, but I'd love to... Uh, uh, See you come later. <laughs> if you have any questions, I'm here to help. But really, I'm still learning. I'm watching other people's videos. I'm doing a good job. I'll link some videos below after this is done of some people that I really liked watching. And and um, also, just ask. Minicam is cool. And I'm feeling around with it. But it's easy to get overwhelmed at once with so many things and technology. Ah, But don't worry. Go slow. You got this. Right now, I'm just playing with effects and the presets because I know what I want to do, but how to do it? Hmm, that's where the question is, how to do it. <laughs> well, good job. Good job, everyone.
I said that to my classmates. Good job, everyone. Goodbye, everyone. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more videos like this, let me know what kind of things you want to see, and I'll put together some fun stuff, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.